I'm Fee. I'm Iz. And we are Fizz. Fizz. And we're here to tell you about our new single, Lens. Cheers! Where to start? It, it's a tale as old as time. Esther's child, hopeless romantic. AKA me. Turns 25, realizes she's a lesbian. It's a girl, a, a girl at a rooftop party and and falls in love. Writes the love song, only to get heartbroken. We had decided that we were going to leave New York City for a hiatus to really focus on finding our sounds. The genesis of the song happened. We were leaving the city. You didn't know if you were with this girl, not with this girl. We, we were decided also... to make the song anyway. I was staying with my brother for two weeks and I was like, Noah, please just like make a track for me. I, I don't know why. I don't know if I thought I was still gonna send it to her. I was just like, I just know I wanna finish making this song. And once we laid down the beat, I sent it to Isabel and she was like, who this, cares yeah, we're, about we're, what this girl like, thinks? Like <laughs> The thing is though, if you've written a good song, I think we can go further with it. What was that one song that was like your inspiration for the first iteration of it? Yeah, I really wanted to make a song that sounded like In Your Body by Teo. Ultimate like sex So it started song. as like a Teo inspiration song. <laughs> that's not really song. the vibe for Fizz and because it was like a personal project, that's why the like bones of the song are so different right. than what we've normally written. The demo that Noah made, we sat with it for a while. The first version of the song was this girl's name essentially over and over again in different ways. And obviously we weren't gonna have that, so. <laughs> the EP like as a total is supposed to be a sensory experience of a yeah. night out. Each and every song was like supposed to be associated with a sense. The song was all about breath. It took us a while to land on the name lungs. The word lungs what ended up being a through line even though it was just a placeholder name. The verse that you had written, copy and pasted with the chorus I had written. Once that was written into the song, the whole part about like, you're the one who lives in my lungs, yeah. then I think it really all came together. And when we started production on it with our producer, Sitsa, who ended up flying over from Amsterdam to work on it with us. When we first moved into our new apartment in Brooklyn, he was living in our living room for like, it was like <laughs> half week. of the first month. <laughs> Recorded it in our closet. Yeah. As the writing went on, as we added uh, every element, we really let it marinate and sit. As of like today, it's been exactly one year since the first voice memo of this project. So one nice. year of working on, of working on lungs. So <laughs> you should stream it. <laughs> Yeah, this song is for everybody. Anything else you want to say? No.